Om Shanti, welcome back. I have been busy with my mother. She was going through a spine surgery and it has been very successful with all of your prayers. Thanks a lot. And we are moving ahead with good hope of good health for her. And I am back again and we are going to do the recording for 3 days now. Starting with 12th of August, 13th of August, 14th and then we are going to come to 15th of August. So let's go ahead and understand what did Godfather say on 12th of August. Father said, may you be knowledgeful and finish any feeling of dislike by becoming a master ocean of love. So, knowledgeful is a person not having this knowledge about only the worldly things but also knowing how to build up relationships, how to be around people. And a person with that knowledge doesn't have any kind of dislike towards anybody. So let's understand what does God have to say. Father says in the details that children who are knowledgeful, that is those who are knowledgeable, are master oceans of love for everyone. That means they have got no distinction. They don't think about whether somebody has got any kind of difference in race or caste or creed or religion. The face, the looks, the ethnicity, the food, the language and they can still love everybody because they are soul conscious. They are looking at the soul, the beauty of the soul within. Nowadays, even more than the physical wealth, there is a greater need for love. Don't we all agree to that? So become a master version of love and uplift those who defame you. Uh, this is a very big thing. Now This is for the stability of the self. This is for being connected to the higher self. This is for being connected to the infinite being through whom the source of healing, the source of love, the source of happiness continuously flows. If you have got any kind of trouble getting defamed by anybody, anybody disliking us, defaming us and if we become unstable and if you think about revenge, if you think about any jealousy or ego or if we have any kind of trouble in our mental and emotional state because of that person's comment, immediately the connection between the self and the supreme creator finishes and the happiness is gone, the love is gone, and the loneliness sets in, the unhappiness sets in, the dissatisfaction, discontentment sets in. And this is what most of the world has been feeling now. People have become so sensitive to what others say because of which they are disconnected to the supreme infinite love. And that is what we need to learn, that is what we need to absorb within us. So God says, so become a master ocean of love and uplift those who defame you. See a person who is defaming you actually is suffering from within. It's not your fault. That person is really suffering from within. And the only way that you can remove the suffering is by giving them love. So God says then, just as a father has mercy and benevolent feelings for all the children, in the same way, you children who are merciful and oceans of forgiveness, like the father, cannot have any feelings of dislike for anyone. Nobody can come into your radar at that time. It's for your own good. If you can do so, you are a successful person in your life. You have built good relationships. You have wonderful ethics in your workplace. You have no kind of bigotry in your workplace. You have no kind of illusion in your workplace. People are not faking their love for you. People are not faking the disrespect for you. For the respect for you, you have everything which you need to function well. Whether it's your family, whether it's your whether it's your job, whether it's your organization, whether it's your business, it's anything. So the true love only is something which can help us to move ahead in our life and heal ourselves and heal others in our family, in our organization, in our workplace. Now, we're going to record the Hindi version of this with this Om Shanti. 